Mm, I, I've got the, the bed sores, the whole body, and on my thighs and on my bums, it's like I, I bent with water or something. It's all black everywhere I, 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 from here down, only the face. I don't you have it. You hear this thing that my sister, she's saying, you don't have it. That doesn't mean that you're not sick. What she's here speaking here. The moment when you hear someone say, I have this and this in your heart, pray and be serious. Because this, it can happen to you tomorrow. Mm. You don't know. Look here, when we pray for people here, their sickness here, they are left here. <laughs> and you can take it. It's fire of God that burns that sickness. Are you hearing that? Amen. So you, when you are sitting there, pray. Pray, you pray for them in your heart. No, because you love them. Like there, I must pray with her as if I'm praying for my sister. Come. Let me see what you're talking about. Can you show 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 this? Can you, let's see this thing. Look at the screen there. It's bigger than this one. All the body is bigger than that. And all here, like from here. Up to here, it's all black like this. It's like I bent and they are itching. I'm scratching myself at work. I was working day, and they end up sending me to infection control on Monday. Yes. And because they don't want us to wear their long sleeve, they want baby below the elbow. Look at that. So Look at the, the, the screen there. Look at her management head. said uh, the infection management said I can't hide them. I must open them. So I speak with my manager. I ask him only to work for night so that patient Did they can see me. You try to get something to put on your. It's a month now. I went to the doctor. They give me cream antibiotic. It's Can not working. Is, this is painful. Jesus name. Come on. Come on. The spirit. Out. Come on, out, out in the name of Jesus. Come on. Hi, man. You can hear that. Hi. Huh? Hi. What are you doing? What are you doing to her? Just to torture him. Huh? <laughs> you are torturing her. Huh? When? Ritwele, man. Umudirei. Ritwele. Huh? Why? Why, 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 why? 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 Jesus' name. You are free today in Jesus' name. Rise up. Rise up. I want to touch your hair because she hid there. She won't feel pain. You are healed. This thing will go. After a week, come and show us. Amen. Jesus. Greetings in the name of Jesus. Amen. I just want to greet mom and daddy. Uh, my testimony is as follows. Two weeks ago, I came to the church. It was on Wednesday. And they did call for an altar call of those who were sick. And then I was having a, the sauce all on my body and everywhere. And then he prayed for me. And then he just spoke a word. He said, in two weeks, this will go away. And I'm healed. And I left with only black spots. I just want to thank the grace of this house. Amen. So I want to pray for uh, the sick. I'm very much happy for that woman. What is the woman? 
come. Let me see if you truly are healed. Truly those things because are this gone thing, now. Who was there when they dried up. Huh? Even on the body, it's just black spot like this. The whole there are like black spots here. Yeah. Because you will see they are all over your body. Everywhere. So now they, you're no longer feeling pain? No, there is no nothing. Pain. No itching, nothing. I'm no longer... Greetings in the wonderful name of our Lord Jesus Christ. <laughs> Viewers all over the world, welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Wednesday live service under the leadership of Apostle J.B. and Prophetess T.E. Makanenisa. With me here today is my mother who <coughs> came forth to testify regarding the healing that she instantly got two weeks ago. Ma, please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. I'm Jeanette Moloto. I'm from Deep Slot. Two weeks ago, the Apostle called forth people who were sick and you went to the front. Kindly please tell us what was happening. I, it was, by that time when I came to church, I was just coming to church during the two weeks back. And on that Wednesday, it was my third week to come to church. I was having that source even that time. But I didn't get the time to be prayed by that time. So on that Wednesday, and um, Apostle Makananise called the altar call for those who are sick. I was one of them. I was having the sores all over the body and it was itching and I was scratching myself now and then and my thighs were, was, was, were swollen. And he prayed for me and then after, during prayer, he just told me that in two weeks you will be healed. Amen. Yes. And how long have you been experiencing these sores and how have they affected you? Did you go consult with the doctor? If yes, did they give you any diagnosis? I did consult with the doctors. They give me an antibiotic and the cream to apply on them. It was not doing any. The, all of them, they were not doing anything, and they diagnosis at the fungal infection. So, after they prayed for me, it was the first time after a prayer when I slept like a baby. I didn't scratch myself. I just bath. After that, I went to because I buy an anointing water also. Yes, I put that anointing water and then I bathed with them. I applied the creams that I was giving me that was not doing anything. After that, I was fine. I slept from there. It started not to be itching too much until after a week, I was like, and then it started to be healed like this. I just left with this black scars all the body. It was affecting me emotionally because even at work, it was a problem. Because they did change me from my shift to put me on night shift because of that thing. And I'm working with people, with, let me say, like, I'm working with patients. So if they saw this thing, it's not going to, it will affect them too. So to make things easier, they just put me on night duty. Yeah. But now I'm healed. Yes. And two weeks later, you are here to give a testimony. Um, how do you feel after the man of God prayed for you and assured you that after two weeks, you're going to come being healed? Inside me, I was just telling me, after he just prayed for me here, I was just telling myself that I'm already healed. I'm already healed because I was taking the medication, it was not doing anything. I was just telling myself inside that I'm already healed. I know that the man of God touched me and spoke a word upon my life. I'm healed. Amen. Yes. And how would you encourage somebody who's currently watching this? They are sitting at home and they are sick. I can just tell them to come to Charis. If any disease, if they suffered from any disease, they can come to Charis. There is a power here. The power for here and the grace is too much. I can't even explain to anyone because the doctors, the creams and everything were not working to me. But in two weeks, I'm healed. Everything is dry and I don't have any pain or any itching or anything. I'm healed.